Ladies and gentlemen, this is the legendary hey. Winston William the Whip. My brother, my brother name is Glenn Sinclair. Okay. I'm doing this particular for him. He lives in Florida. He idolizes the ground that you walk on for many, 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 many years. He talk like you, you want to sound like you, you want to say everything. So I want you to give a big shout out to my brother Glenn Sinclair. Hey Glenn, hold the faith, keep it gentle, live long and strong. God bless. All right, Winston William, ladies and gentlemen, paying his respect to the legendary Eddie Fitzroy. There's a strong, strong spirit in this place, and I know it is the presence of the Lord. There are sad expressions. On each face And I know it is the presence Of the Lord A very pleasant good morning ladies and gentlemen Welcome once again to Big Stone Television It is with the deepest of regrets That I have to announce the passing of renowned broadcaster and radio disc jockey Winston the Whip Williams. Winston the Whip Williams is dead. Culture Minister Olivia Grange tweeted on Sunday afternoon that the veteran media personality died Sunday morning at the Kingston Public Hospital. She described him as a pioneer of Jamaican radio. I will always remember that engaging baritone voice of the whip and the great music he played on radio, Grange said. Williams joined Radio Jamaica, formerly RJR, in 1963 before leaving three years later to work in the Caribbean as a radio host in Bahamas and MC of Cat and Fiddle Club which featured many of the top names in global music, according to a feature in a 2020 magazine, celebrating the station's 70 year anniversary. In swift order, his speed, accuracy, and perfect diction made him an audience favorite. Trained by the late iconic theater and radio producer Wycliffe Bennett, Williams excelled, it said. He returned to Jamaica in 1967 and joined the Jamaica Broadcasting Corporation as a host of an afternoon show as the whip with the solid kick. Going head to head with Radio Jamaica's El Numero Uno, Dan Tapping, while at JBC he also read radio and television news. After a decade at JBC, Williams rejoined Radio Jamaica, taking over the station afternoon radio slot. He remained there for another decade and a half, hosting several shows, including Saturday Morning, Rock House, and establishing himself as the voice of the 5 p.m. news. In 1992, Williams returned to JBC, where he stayed until 1997, when JBC was acquired by Radio Jamaica. He did add a stint at 102 FM before moving on to Power 106 FM in 2003, which became part of the RJR Gleaner Communications Group after a merger in 2016. Williams also recorded songs for Cox and Dad, Bonnie Lee, and the Jackpot label. The late broadcaster won many awards, including the El Susie Red Stripe Award in 1972 as the best this jacket on the year. Now ladies and gentlemen, you saw that clippings I played at the beginning of this tribute. That was at Eddie Fitzroy's funeral when I met up with Winston the Whip Williams and I convey a message from my brother that I love so much, Glenn Sinclair, you know, of how Glenn idolized him and admire him. And I had to tell the whip of how my brother felt about him. And he was so kind that he actually spoke to Glenn through my television lens and says, Glenn, hold the faith, live a long life, 
and you saw the clip. Well, ladies and gentlemen, when I spoke to Glenn this morning, Glenn said, Claude, where have you been? I've been trying to reach you since yesterday. I got the news that my icon, the legend, Winston the Whip William, is dead. And I said, Glenn, yes, I thought about you. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, Glenn did a tribute to Winston the Whip Williams. This is what my big brother, Glenn Sinclair, had to say. Take a listen. To the family, relatives, friends, and the entire Jamaica, I share with you the passing, the grief that must be felt in the passing of an icon, the great Winston the Whip Williams, also known as Winston the Conscious One from Kingston, and the little known one, Sir Marcus Antonius. Winston was very instrumental to me in my emceeing career and this jockeying, and I'll always miss you, Winston. You offered a lot ju just to me and to other local DJs here in Florida, because I've heard your jingles with that, but to the entire Jamaica. And so I'm sharing in this passing this day. You are the master of your trade. You had what it takes to be a true a numero uno in terms of broadcasting. And I know, like you have always said, when these situations arise, he or she is gone to the great beyond, gone to be in the bosom of our Lord and Savior. Sleep on, my brother, and you're going to be who you want to be. Wow, wow, Glenn. That was well said, my brother. Thank you so much for those kind words. And ladies and gentlemen, it touches the core of my heart because at this moment, I want to offer my sincerest of condolences to Winston's family, friends, and many fans scattered across the world. I understand your pain. I know exactly how one's feel when one loses a loved one, someone as dear as a father, a husband, a brother, an uncle, a grandfather. Winston was such a dynamic individual. He has taught so many people, including myself, how to be great at what you do. And for that, I just want to say to the families that I understand your pain my sincerest and heartfelt condolences to you at this time. Winston was a great individual, a powerful disjockey, one that led by example. And I know personally that Winston will be missed, not just here in Jamaica, or the Bahamas, or the Caribbean, but all over. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have a tribute to an icon, a legend, gone too soon, Winston the Whip Williams. The Whip with a solid kick. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and share this video. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, now is the time to do so. Thank you so much for watching.